Hey guys, Hayabusa is still one of the best assassins in the game, and it's been a while since the last time I played him. I used to play him quite a lot back then, but because he's so strong, I decided not to play him anymore. You know, you gotta make the game more interesting by picking the underdog heroes. But before we continue, a quick shout out to the amazing sponsor of this video. Mech Arena is a casual and very fast paced mech shooting game while still keeping the competitive aspect if that's what you want. It requires not only good aiming, but also tactics as well because you can also use mech's ability to outplay your opponent. There is a huge variety of unique skills and strategy that will bring a new level of depth to the gameplay. Customize them according to your playstyle and to your favorite mechs. Try all sorts of different builds and find out which one suits you the most. Right now my favorite weapon is the high burst laser gun. You can literally demolish any mech with just one or two shots. Also, they are adding a lot of new stuff for this month, such as the brand new pilot, Maverick, and new map, Paradise Plaza, and they have a lot more events happening this month. The game is completely free to play on both Android and iOS, and if you use my personal link or scan the QR code on the screen, you'll receive the Steel Reaper skin, along with 500 A coins and 7000 credits. This is my player ID, and maybe we can play some matches together if you see me online. It seems like in our team, there is an internal competition about who can perform the best with low match heroes. We all have the same thought, to make the match as interesting as possible. Smiley face. It's important to make sure that the second skill hit the targets directly, so you can combo with his first skill. If you manage to land your shadow, then ideally you want to use the first skill first, then TP right on top of the target. I believe turns a rugged terrain into a thoroughfare. Unfortunately, I just used my old, so I cannot really fully commit, but at least I can try to lower their HP as much as possible. It's never worth training your life for the buff. I kinda noticed that he uses more energy than before. Correct me if I'm mistaken. I guess now we should conserve a little bit more and not use this dash that often just to clear the jungle. Especially when you don't have the blue buff. Witness in the real power of the shadow. He's your first enemy. It's usually easier to gain the gold lane, and more effective as well, since your marksman will have more control over his lane. Roger is clearing the jungle, 
Let's see if we can do something about it. When the tank is paying attention to the place, things just become so much easier. I go try to take the turtle here, but my whole team is in the top lane, so if their jungler and bottom laner come to contest it, it might be quite risky for us. There is no end. In the way of the ninja. My belief is turn the dragon terrain into a turtle. We already got what we came for. Let's play the objective game and just take the turtle. My belief carried me here. He shall carry me first. Let's wait until Guinevere uses her jump first before engaging her. There's a chance my ult will target her clone, that's why. It was awful. Every cloud has a 100% deserve to die here. Gotta get used to panning around the map often when playing Hayabusa. That's how you can increase his dash accuracy. There's nothing else to do in the middle lane anymore. Let's play the objective game and just take the Lord. Nobody wants to help take the objectives. Sad face. In the shadows, I see. I try to be sneaky and take down the inhibitor as quickly as possible. I thought I'll be able to destroy it a lot faster than this. But in hindsight, this was definitely not worth the trade. Since we got the Lord, Expert shouldn't be clearing the minion wave like this. 
we should align all the lanes so they can all push at the same time. Betrayal must be paid back. Ruby's movement is very sus. Why is she moving towards us like this? That made me suspect somebody was hiding in the upper bush. It's not about me. It's about me. This assassin is so strong that even someone who played this hero rarely can still do quite decently. So if you ever want to master an assassin and don't like getting killed that often, then this is probably one of the best options for you. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, consider leaving a like and subscribing.